Hi, uh, I'm Gareth Wild. I'm studying over at Creative Arts and I have a double major in graphic design and digital visual arts. The illustration lecturers have quite a wealth of knowledge that um, you're hard pressed to find it in any book anywhere. Um, they really know their craft really well and yeah, they're incredibly helpful in sort of putting forth all that knowledge for you. The expertise from our lecturers um, and their, their constant um, encouragement and feedback is really helpful for, for us, us as a student to develop our professional skills and technique. Just an abundance of um, graphics tablets to work with, computers, um, it's all really catered for. Um, I find the facilities top notch. I mean, the 24-hour the access to the computer labs and the studios, all the latest Canon um, 5D Mark IIs. We've got one um, Infinity Cove cyclorama. Pretty much anything you need to pull off a professional shoot. The facilities really are impeccable. Uh, we have 24-hour access, which is um, incredibly helpful for all of us night owls who pretty much work throughout the entire night. Um, as far as both uh, teaching staff and facilities go, uh, there are a wealth of knowledge to be found in the teachers and they're very, very good. Yes, they're, they're quite generous with their feedback. Um, yeah, they, they definitely know when to um, sort of hold back on the feedback to kind of drive you to, to push yourself to get that positive feedback again. Many of the subjects kind of pushes you to break a few boundaries, such as contacting industry people, um, which is the scariest thing of all, is like contacting basically heroes within your craft. And actually realizing that you get positive replies from most of them is kind of a door opener. Yeah, facilities are, are very, very good. Uh, Mac Labs, uh, which have basically everything you need, and they're air conditioned. Thank God. The motivation and inspiration doesn't always come at the most pleasant hours of day, so it's good to have 24-hour access and, and pleasant weather. It's mainly had an impact on my career path uh, within the interactive part of it. What we've or what I've gained from doing this degree is basically building upon uh, what I already learned in Norway of graphic design with uh, both movie and visual arts and web design. Actually, develop your skills further than the printed medium. Australia, or Australian life in general, is a good Norwegian summer. Uh, that's been a very pleasant or conversion for me. People are very friendly. Uh, they're, they're good people. The difference between Australia and Norway is mainly the culture. Here people are really open-minded, easy to get to know. You get accepted really quick. Mainly good, good, good barbecues, good weather, and a general pleasant lifestyle down here. The Creative Exchange is a, a third year core subject. Uh, creative Exchange is a collaborative project, cross-disciplinary. And uh, essentially what it is, is they're, they're getting like a, a sort of a collective pool. You break off into different groups and um, you, you pull all the your skills and attributes that you've sort of accumulated throughout the, the three-year course. And uh, you're working on a sort of like a real-life project, really, something that uh, you want to impress industry with, something that will add to your portfolio. The, the techniques that we've learnt, the people skills, um, everything has is, is helped us really step in, into the industry. Um, getting feedback from industry people as well, um, it shows that we actually are quite ahead of the rest of the crowd. Um, you should come to JCU because <laughs> it's fantastic. The people is pretty much the top one reason why I like Australia because it's so easy to get to know people and the way we got received in the beginning as well is just amazing compared to what I feel like it would have been in Norway and I think I made some lifelong friends here.